Everyone knows that chocolate is bad for dogs, but what other toxins are there in your home that are normal household goods but could still be harmful to your pets? We're going to have a look at some of them today. The first one, that probably one of the more common ones, is avocado. It's real bad for your dog. It can lead to kidney failure and all sorts of other problems. Another problem that you might have is grapes. In the old days, we used to freeze grapes and give them to our dogs, but we've now realized that that's not a good thing for them to have. If you want to give them something that's really good, take a look at carrots or strawberries. Freezing them, keeping them in a little baggie, and then giving to your dog as treats are really good. And then there's some grasses out there that you can pick up at pet store. This particular one is from Pet Greens. It's really good. Clip a little clippings into the food and it's actually pretty good for them. Of course, things like chicken and turkeys at uh, Thanksgiving time, that's really bad for your dog. Any kind of processed foods or foods that we eat as humans, that's something you don't want to be feeding your dogs. And then watch out for little bones hanging around the house, leaving them on plates. Cats could get to them, dogs could get to them. And obviously something like this could be really dangerous for your dog. We have a great graphic on our Facebook page, Partners Dog Training School, that details some of the other things that are harmful to your dog. Print it out, put it up in the refrigerator, make sure that the family know about it. And so what do you do if your dog has been exposed to a potential harmful toxin? First thing is, call a vet, call a poison hotline. Don't induce vomiting, because sometimes that can be detrimental to your dog. Try and flush it out with water if that's available to you, and always treat all poisonings as emergencies, because you just don't know what's going to happen next. And be safe out there.